Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. And in this video, I'm be showing you how to increase the block limit for the fill command and the clone command. So if you like my videos like this one, then please make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more micro tutorials in the future. Now first, a couple of points to take into account when you want to do this. First of all, this is currently only possible on Minecraft Java Edition and it has only been added in one of the recent snapshots 23w03a for Minecraft 1.19.4. So if you don't play on any of those versions, this will not work. So just make sure you're in Java Edition and in a version later than snapshot 23w03a or version 1.19.4 or higher. And so then the regular block limit for both the fill command, the clo command, as well as the fill biome command is around 32,000 blocks. And this is actually quite small. 32,000 blocks sounds like a lot, but it's actually only 30 by 30 by 30 blocks or so, or a bit more. And a lot of your structures might be a whole lot bigger than this, or you might want to fill a way larger area with blocks. Like, for example, what I did behind me, there's a 200 by 200 by 200 cube of diamond blocks over here, which is actually around 8.1 million blocks. And if you wanted to do this using the regular fill block limit, you would have to use that block limit 250 times before you could get this block of diamond blocks. So this can actually save you quite a lot of time. And so before I show you how to actually increase limit, I will warn you that if you don't have a powerful PC, you shouldn't be cloning or filling more than a million blocks at once. It will completely crash your PC. When I tried to fill this 200 by 200 by 200 block area of volume of diamond blocks, it took around a minute to load in. So I don't recommend using this for extreme measures, such as this one right behind me. But all you need to do is type in the following command, of course, first activate cheats, and then type in the command slash game rule command modification block limit tab. There we go. That is the command we are looking for. I'll leave it in the description down below as well. So you can copy it from there if you don't feel like typing it out. But what you need to do is set this to a number higher than 32,000. And so I think currently I've set it to 400 million, which that's way too high because... I don't think my PC will handle 400 million, but you can set it to whatever number you want. I recommend setting it to something that your computer can handle. So for me, 8 million was already quite pushing it. So let's set it to 20 million like this. Just put in 20 million and then press enter. And we've set the command modification block limit to that specific value. And now all we need to do is just test it out to see if it has worked. And so we'll go over here and just try to use the fill command first. So we'll stand on this tree and then use the fill command. So we'll fill an area from where we are right now over to, let's say, 250, 250, 250. And we'll fill it with emerald blocks. Why not? Should we make it hollow? Yeah, let's make it hollow. Why not? And then press enter. Aha. See, this is where your problems might come in. That position is not loaded. What we need to do then is just increase our render distance a bit. So go into video settings and increase our render distance. Now that position should definitely be loaded. Let's also make this a negative one so it spawns in the right direction. Ah, now it's out of this world. Then we'll just have to reduce the size there because it probably has to place it above the block limit. Try it again. And there we go, now it has worked because we don't see anything happening in the chat. And there we go, we got 325,000 blocks. That wasn't too big of a deal. Apparently it is though. Okay, apparently my PC didn't like that, even though the one with 8 million blocks went a lot smoother. This went a lot faster though, but yeah, there we go. That is just a massive, massive space of emerald blocks. That's quite cool. You don't often see these types of large rooms in Minecraft. And so of course, if we didn't make it hollow, it would be filled with a whole lot more blocks. That would also probably work just like we have over there with a big diamond block. But now let's try something else. And that is using the clone command. We'll try to clone over this beautiful woodland mansion to a different place. So let's make sure we select the entire structure. We'll go underwater, go all the way down here. I think we should be able to grab the entire woodland mansion like this. We'll grab our first coordinate down here. And then move all the way to the other side of the Woodland Mansion and grab a second coordinate up here somewhere. Let's say over here. All right, there it is. That is definitely more than 32,000 blocks. And where should we clone this Woodland Mansion to? Let's clone it right above the ocean somewhere. So we'll go over here and try to clone the structure right here. So add our coordinates. There we go. And press enter. Now, this will take a while, I assume. Oh, no, that was 
fairly quick actually. We just cloned over 552,552 blocks. That's a nice number. And look at that, there it is. Oh wow, we actually cloned right on top of the azalea tree and you can see all the rooted dirt below it. That's quite nice actually. There's the start of a lush cave down here. So if we move to the front, we'll see, yes, there is our woodland mansion and all the water is beautifully falling down on top of the ocean monument down there. But as you can see, it worked perfectly fine. We could copy over 500,000 blocks with no real issues. And so there we go. That is how to increase the block limit for the fill command, the fill biome command, and also the clone command. If you have any more questions about this, then please let me know about them in the comments down below. And if you enjoyed this video, then please make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more Minecraft tutorials like this one in the future. I want to thank my tier 3 member, the Smikla. Thank you for becoming a tier 3 member. But anyway, there we go. Hope you all enjoyed this video. Hope to see you all in the next one. So until then, bye-bye.